mixed use project in downtown. So, so uh, that bodes well for our future, having more people uh, that ever live here. Um, I think right now the, the number's around 15,000 you know, that live in downtown Orlando. So uh, uh, we're definitely moving in the right direction. Isn't that right, Jay? Isn't that right, Jay? Absolutely. All right. <laughs> <laughs> I be validated. Uh, last time I saw this guy, we were, there was one of those special events going on in downtown Orlando on a Sunday afternoon uh, a couple Sundays ago, and I came down. And there were about 10,000 people all throughout downtown Orlando here for what was called a V2 Lab car show. They don't ask me what V2 Lab is, I don't know, it's a social media thing, you know, but it was extremely well attended. They probably had three or 400 show cars, and it was just people, families, all over downtown. And I stopped by 7-Eleven, and um, I stood in there for 15 minutes, and Jay didn't even notice me. I'm the tallest guy in the place, right? <laughs> I, I, he was so busy, they were so slammed. And of course, um, as a former, 19-year uh, merchant myself. It's uh, it's music to my ears and beautiful for me to see, beautiful to me to see that going on. So uh, that's what we want. Um, when you boil it down, those of us at the Downtown Development Board and the CRA want to do two very very simple things. We want to bring more customers to downtown businesses, and we want to bring more businesses to downtown customers. And that's what, that's overly simplified, but that's what we're about.